Hey Minecrafters, it's Court here and we're back in my Let's Play world and uh, this time I thought it was, well I thought it was about time to get organised. So um, what I plan to do here is I've set up a little board here or a little a wall and I'm going to create a few signs here. I'm going to put a, like a, a list of things to do. So you know, perhaps each episode we can go through uh, some of these items on the wall uh, just to make sure you know I know what I'm doing, and uh, you know, just making sure that uh, you know get things done. So I'm going to start off here. Let's put a first sign here, and that's have a think about things right so there's a few things I know straight away I need to get sorted so first of all, I need to protect the village um, so I love I put a lot of torches around the village but it's not stopping mobs from wandering into the village so you know I'll occasionally get um, zombies still occasionally wandering in um, and I'm sort of going in and fending them off so um, I still need to sort of protect it and put things around it so protect the village let's put that in there Okay, um, I'm going to add something else on, on the list here. So, what else we got? So, protect the village. Um, what I need to do is create a simple tree farm actually, because I'm always in need of more wood. Um, so, tree farm. And in fact, you always need farms, don't you? So, um, I also need pigs, pig farms for food. So, uh, pig farm. My cow farm's already down there, so that's fine. Um, uh, chickens. Um, I'll put chick farm. Hmm, I'm doing my capitalization all across the board. Um, what else? Farm sugar. Yeah, sugar. Um, I need to be making a lot of books because I need to make an enchanting table. Enchanting table, but no, okay. Enchanting table. Um, okay, I will want to make a uh, portal, which I, can, I think I've got the materials to do that now. I've got enough obsidian, I've, I've mined some obsidian. So, another portal. Okay, because then I can start harvesting other things. Uh, what else? What else do we need? Um, a storeroom, actually. With all this material, I need a storeroom. So it's always good to have a list of things. That way, you can you can always keep focused on what you're doing. Okay. Um, what else? Um, tree farm. Da -da -da, protect. Uh, ah, yeah. That's one thing that's really frustrated me. So <clears throat> one thing I noticed with the village that's nearby is that. There is actually no uh, carrots and potatoes there, so I need to go wandering, unfortunately, to see if I can find another village that has carrots and potatoes, unless there's another easy way of getting them uh, from mob drops or something. Um, I really could do with getting um, some carrots and potatoes sort of farm, so um, find another village. I'll just put find village. Okay. And once I create this other village, it might be nice to make a, a minecart system actually, a travel system. Yes, yeah, so I could have some sort of central hub, a train hub, and then I could have my minecarts going off there. And I'll make it like a monorail system that's raised above the ground, so it's sort of generally protected. Um, quite like the, the sound of that actually. Looking forward to building that. Um, what else? I've always fancied building a tower, a lookout tower. I'll just put tower. And of course, good old mob spawners. Uh, so I'm able to look out for mob spawners. I'll need to make one for XP. Um, okay, right, anything else here I can think of? Uh, right, I need to, s need to find slimes so I can build my st sticky pistons and so so slime farm. Let's find those guys. See where where they're uh, hiding out. Um, what else we got here? Um, I think I'll do for the moment anyway. Okay, so we've got a few things there. To be getting on with. Um, 
so I just need to get organized and I'll light up light up more of the areas hang on let's, let's I have thought of a few more things so slime farm smooth out land is that fit yeah okay and more torches what I mean by that more torches is that there's still some of the local area I haven't sort of lit up and I need to light up all the caves around the area because if I'm eventually going to make a, a mob spawner I need to make sure that I've lit up um, all the caves and all the surrounding areas as much as I can so that when I choose to spawn the mobs they're going to spawn where I need them to spawn and that's going to take time um, okay great so I've now got my list and so now I can pick something from the list to do and get started so I think one of the first things I'm going to do today is protect the village okay because I'm spending my time and every time it's dark is pop it over to the village and protect them because the villagers unfortunately aren't that smart um, so I need to grab some materials and I'm gonna make some fences Ooh, I can hear a skeleton Ooh, there he is outside there hello uh, let's go to sleep okay Right, so I need to make some cobblestone uh, fences. I'm going to do cobblestone and not fence fence because simply because it's easier to get hold of the, the cobblestone than it is the uh, normal wood. Because I haven't really made a proper tree farm yet. And I think I'll just be make a change. Now, I've got to remember how to make a cobblestone. Uh, and that's how we've got here. Okay. So, cobblestone fence. So, what do you reckon here? There we go. Cobblestone wall. Um, I need to make some more space here. So, let's just skip. Actually, let's try and be organised. Let's get rid of that. Um, what else have we got? Some stone. Right, so this is another reason I need a store. I need to really tidy some some of this stuff up. Right, more cobblestone. So let's have some of that, some of that, and let's make some more here. So, okay, okay, that's pretty good. We've got a few there. Okay, so let's go down to the village and fence some of this off now. Okay. I'm going to fence this off and I'll be uh, back in a minute. Okay, right, okay, so I've been pretty busy um, putting up the uh, the wall, the cobblestone wall around the villager. Uh, village? Villager village. Well, well, that sounds a bit silly. Um, so as you can see here, uh, I've got cobblestone wall all around the perimeter here. So I've got all the way around. You can see all the way down there. And I put a few gates in here and there just so I can get in. And so let's just go in here actually. And I've also smoothed out the land a little bit round here as well, just to neaten things up. And I've got rid of some of the gravel that was in the ground, just made it look a little bit untidy. And put some wooden steps in occasionally just to neaten things up. So it just makes the village a little bit more. Um, easy to navigate um, and nicer to look at and now it's protected so I can rest assured that at night time my villagers are going to be safe because you never know when you may want to trade I don't know four emeralds for an iron spade oh, diamond pickaxe there you go oh, that would take uh, forever to get those but yeah what do you sell okay emeralds so there we go, so that's protected the village now, so I'm happy that's done, that's now out of the way, and that I can tick off my list. Okay, so what's next? Um, well, I think I could be getting on with a tree farm, at least something simple. I have 
had lots of trees outside my house before. Um, but of course, you always have you always have that problem whereby one of the trees, I think it's about one in ten, I think is the chance, that creates a really tall tree, and it becomes a real pain to cut down. Um, so what I want to do really is make some sort of tree farm whereby a they won't go above a certain height, easy to cut down, and that collecting things from them will be nice and easy as well. So I'll cut them down. I won't hang around to collect saplings. I'll use something like hoppers to collect all the drop drops, and I'll come back and pick them up later. So really, what I want to do now is come up with a suitable area to put uh, my tree farm. Um, I am sort of thinking somewhere out here, <clears throat> next to my quarry. Um, yeah, how about? Well, how about down here somewhere? So near the bottom. So I don't want to put it too near the house just to fill things up. So down the bottom here somewhere. I can create a tree farm or a little building that put all my trees in. I can create rows of trees and just harvest them as I need. Um, somewhere. Yeah, I think somewhere that, down here. Uh, am I, I'm not actually at water level yet. Okay. Yeah, somewhere around here. Okay. Um, okay, guys. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to leave the episode as it is. So that was just really about me protecting the village. Um, so if you've got a village as well, then it's very easy to do. Just light up the place and place a load of cobblestone uh, walls everywhere. Uh, okay, guys, thanks for watching. If you like the series, like I say, don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, more coming, and I'll see you again soon. Bye, Bye for now.